you know, the mobile fence, uh, one of the things I'll teach is you spiral away. So you're still facing the guy, but anybody watching, that's your moment to prepare your witnesses. People who are looking to create trouble, they don't want attention. They want to close the distance. Excuse me, sir, I've lost some, you know, I'm out of money. If you give me your address, you know, you know they have this pattern to close the distance. And, um, you know, so I, you know so I'll just say something like, leave me alone. The body language is strong. I don't have my fists up, but I'm not saying stay away, don't hurt me. See the difference in the, you know, to me, this is, I'm afraid. But this is, I'm declaring my space, I'm not making fists, but if I'm also spiraling away and I'm saying, leave me alone, I am preparing my witnesses. I am calling attention, and then anybody who looks over and sees what's going on, they see, I'm, a, you know, I'm trying to create distance, and I'm making very clear that just respect my bubble and we're fine. But if you wait, if the fight is already started, when you people hear a commotion and they look over and they see a fight and then they see you win, they will likely testify that you were the aggressor. So these are some practical things to, pe to think about, you know, when situations get started. See, the, the reason I ask that is because you're one of the few people that after I trained at one of your events, I had that aha moment because I was trained for, for a very, very long time in how to act but not when, you know, so dealing with those, those initial That's a wonderful things. distinction. But, you know, it was that same thing where enforcing your space, I always, I was always told, you know, uh, you have to have self-control and you, you know, you always need to deescalate. And because I'm a big dude, I had lost my temper as I, when I was young and, and, you know, gotten fights where people got hurt in a way that they didn't have to. But I, I, because I didn't learn how that standoff distance and how to enforce your space and me, be more aggressive, it got me in more trouble. Whereas if I had been taught, look, no, this is, this is my area and I'm going to enforce it. That's safe. Now I, it's been, I can't, I don't even know how long it's been since I've been in an altercation for exactly that reason, where as soon as you see something starting to happen, you deal with it initially.